Hey guys, in today's lesson video, I'm going to talk about how to straighten your trail leg so you could have a lot of freedom and rotation to the top of your backswing. So what I see from a lot of amateur golfers is that from their setup position, they have a certain amount of knee flex and they have this hinge in their hips. And what they do is, to the top of the backswing, they keep this knee flex and they keep their hinge in their hips to the top of the backswing. And even for myself, I could only rotate around 45 degrees when I keep this hip pinch and if I keep my knee flex. And what we have to realize is that even Tiger Woods, back in 97, he had a golf swing where he kept his knee flex and he kept, kept his hip pinch and he rotated perfectly fine. But even for Tiger Woods, now he started to straighten his trail leg to get that freedom to rotate to the top of the backswing. So now let's talk about that. How come the greatest player ever to play had this problem, but he got away with it? It's because he was very flexible. If you keep your hip hinge, and if you keep your knee flex, and you try to rotate, you have to be very flexible. And it's just a range of motion difficulty that you're going to come up with. So what we have to realize is that straightening our trail leg is going to help us rotate more in the backswing. And a good tip is our trail hip has to rotate towards the target in this manner. And that's naturally going to get our trail leg to straighten in the backswing. And what we have to realize is that we're not trying to lock out our knees. All we're doing is we're just extending our trail leg and we're getting our hips and our trail leg to straighten and get a little bit farther away from the golf ball. So just like a gym workout, just like a leg press, we're not trying to lock out our knees. We're just extending and we're just getting taller on our trail side. So hopefully this lesson video helps and hopefully you guys like the lesson video. If you guys like the lesson video, please like and subscribe to help my channel grow. And for online lessons on Skillist, I'll leave a link in the description below. Thanks guys.